Hi everyone. Many of you would be aware that the last few weeks have been extremely challenging with high teacher staff absence due to illness. We are currently sitting close to 10 COVID cases, often with 15 to 20 more teachers taking sick or carers leave on any given day. This is being extremely well managed by operations team and I appreciate the fact that all staff are being called to do their bit to support those who are away unwell. I also feel our students are quite agile and resilient in this space and the skills that we learned through remote learning has enabled the learning to continue whilst they or their teacher are absent. Regardless of this, we feel we've been able to provide all of our scheduled experience, experiences this term, uh, all of which complement the teaching and learning. An example of this was our Year 8s participating in their Year 8 renewals from the Courage to Care team. The Courage to Care team share personal experiences from the Holocaust, conveying the importance of being upstanders in our community. The students got to also participate in other sessions focusing on mindfulness, respect for relationships and interfaith dialogue. This renewal complements the learning in the Year 8 Religious Education curriculum. We're also excited to have 21 Year 10 and 11 students attending the Lake Mungo Immersion next week, leaving on June 20 for a week. Teachers Ash Crook and Tanya Willard, along with the Red Earth team, will lead this immersion. This is the first time since COVID that we've participated in, in an immersion and the first time we've visited the World Heritage listed Bulundra Lakes region. Situated southwest New South Wales, the 240,000 hectare site is home to a network of dried saltwater lake beds which provide incredible insight into the deep past of Australia. We wish this group a safe and meaningful experience. Our students are all participating in exams this week and I thank all families for helping them prepare and participate with a positive mindset. Students will be able to receive their exam feedback in the final week of term with many of our classes commencing semester two units. Our staff will utilise the Professional Practice Day on Friday, June 24 to finalise the Semester 1 reports that will become available for all families that evening. Our 2022 Annual Giving Campaign commenced this week and this initiative enables many of our students who are unable to afford an SJC education the ability to attend and learn at St Joseph's. Every gift, no matter the size, has a positive influence on our boys' learning environment. It gives every boy the opportunity to fill, fulfil his personal potential benefiting their college community, learning environment and programs to strive for the highest. I'll hand back the principal reins to Tony Patch at the end of this term and I'll be forever grateful for the opportunity to lead this great community as acting principal this term. I felt so much support from the students, from the staff, the families at the college and I've thoroughly enjoyed the experience. I hope everyone enjoys the mid-year break and stays healthy and safe. God bless.